step into a lively TV series from 1985 that became a household favorite. Set in a close-knit apartment building, the sitcom captures the daily ups and downs of its colorful residents. Can you recall a specific scene or moment that stayed with you? As you immerse yourself in the episodes, be ready for a mix of emotions. The show offers a blend of humor, surprises, and touching moments that will keep you hooked. Wondering why this series is still remembered today? It's all about how relatable, funny, and genuinely connected the characters are. Now, think back. What's your fondest memory or personal experience with this show? Share your stories and thoughts in the comments below. Keep watching for more amusing, surprising, and emotional moments yet to unfold. Which scene made you laugh out loud? Whose journey resonated with you? Let's reminisce about the timeless charm of this series. The 1985 TV series 227 has left a lasting impression on television. This sitcom, set in an apartment building, shares the daily lives of its diverse residents. What makes 227 stand out is its seamless blend of humor, surprises, and heartfelt moments. The characters, each with their unique qualities, connect with audiences, creating a captivating story. What sets 227 apart is its ability to make you laugh, surprise you, and tug at your heartstrings. The characters' relatable experiences mirror real life, making it easy for audiences to connect with them. The show doesn't just entertain, it reflects the ups and downs of life, creating a strong bond with viewers. Looking back at the impact of 227, it's not just about the funny moments, but also the emotional depth that touched our hearts. The show goes beyond being just a sitcom. It's a powerful story that withstands the test of time. Its influence extends beyond its original run, shaping later TV shows that aim to capture the essence of community, humor, and authentic connections. 227 has undeniably left its mark on the television landscape, earning its place among classic sitcoms. Today, as we remember the laughter, surprises, and touching moments 227 brought into our lives, we appreciate its enduring charm. The characters may be fictional, but their relatable experiences make them feel like old friends. The show's ability to make us laugh and feel ensures its special place in the hearts of those who enjoyed its magic. In conclusion, 227 remains relevant because it goes beyond a simple sitcom. It is a reflection of the human experience, a story woven with humor, heart, and genuine connections that withstand the test of time. As we celebrate the impact and legacy of this series, we continue to value the laughter and camaraderie it brought into our lives. Let's explore the creative minds behind the 1985 TV series 227. At the helm were its creators, Reed and Malcolm Jamal Warner, who envisioned a lively narrative set in a close-knit apartment building. Their collaboration infused the show with a unique mix of humor, surprises, and genuine connections, creating its lasting charm. Behind the scenes, the producers played a crucial role in shaping the show's direction. Notable figures like Marla Gibbs, who also played Mary Jenkins, brought their expertise, ensuring each episode resonated authentically. The production team's commitment to portraying life's ups and downs in a humorous yet heartfelt manner contributed to the series' timeless appeal. Directors such as Ellen Falcon and Orlando Smith skillfully navigated the narrative, capturing the essence of the characters' daily lives. Their adept direction allowed with the cast to shine, creating a cohesive and engaging viewing experience. Now, turning our attention to the cast, a stellar ensemble breathed life into the memorable characters. Marla Gibbs, as Mary Jenkins, brought a nuanced portrayal, balancing humor with genuine emotions. Hal Williams portrayed Lester Jenkins, Mary's husband, with a delightful mix of charm and wit. The chemistry between Gibbs and Williams added depth to the show's portrayal of a loving couple navigating everyday challenges. The supporting cast, including Elena Reed Hall, Jack A. Harry, and Regina King, each contributed unique talents. Hall's portrayal of Rose Lee Holloway, Harry's sassy and outspoken Sandra Clark, and a young Regina King's early foray into acting as Brenda Jenkins all added layers to the characters. The casting process, marked by a keen eye for talent, led to a lineup that not only entertained but also resonated with audiences. Interesting trivia surrounds the audition process, with some actors landing roles that would later become well-known in television. As we celebrate the creators, producers, directors, and cast of the show, it's evident that their collective efforts shaped a series that goes beyond being just a sitcom. 
227 became a showcase of the enduring power of humor, heart, and genuine connections, leaving a lasting impression on television. In the early seasons of the series, Kia Goodwin played the role of Rose Holloway's daughter, Tiffany. However, her character underwent significant changes as the show progressed. By the second season, Tiffany's screen time was noticeably reduced. Surprisingly, by the fourth season, her character vanished without any explanation, similar to the disappearances of characters like Chuck Cunningham in Happy Days and Judy Winslow in Family Matters. Marla Gibbs, a central figure in 227, recreated a memorable scene from four years prior on The Jeffersons in one of the episodes. The familiarity of the hammering the bell moment added a nostalgic touch for viewers familiar with Gibbs' earlier work. While the original play had a different backdrop 1950s Chicago, Illinois 227 was set in contemporary Washington, D.C. This transition brought a fresh perspective to the narrative, capturing the essence of everyday life in a community. As we explore the creative elements behind the show, it's essential to acknowledge the collaborative efforts of its creators, Reed and Malcolm Jamal Warner. Their vision for a dynamic narrative set in a close-knit community laid the foundation for the enduring charm of the show. The production team, including notable figures like Marla Gibbs, contributed to the authenticity of each episode, ensuring a genuine portrayal of life's highs and lows. Behind the camera, directors such as Ellen Falcon and Orlando Smith skillfully guided the narrative, allowing the ensemble cast to shine. Marla Gibbs, in her role as Mary Jenkins, brought a nuanced portrayal, blending humor and authentic emotions. Hal Williams, portraying Lester Jenkins, added charm and wit to the depiction of a loving couple navigating the challenges of everyday life. The supporting cast, featuring talents like Elena Reed Hall, Jack K. Harry, and a young Regina King, brought unique dimensions to their characters. The meticulous casting process resulted in a lineup that not only entertained, but also resonated with a diverse audience. In reflecting on the impact of 227, it becomes clear that the series transcended the typical sitcom format. It became a showcase of the enduring power of humor, heart, and genuine connections, solidifying its place in television history. Mary Jenkins, the central character in 227, celebrates her birthday on June 14, keeping the year a well-guarded secret. A subtle yet interesting detail that adds a sense of mystery to her character. Jack A. Harry, who gained fame through the show, left at the end of the fourth season, choosing a sitcom venture that never happened. Notably, her absence continued in the series finale, leaving a gap in the ensemble cast. After the show was canceled, a reunion occurred as Marla Gibbs and Jack A. Harry shared the screen once more in the first family. Gibbs took on the role of Grandma Eddie in a recurring capacity, while Harry played her daughter, marking a reunion of two key figures from the 227 universe. The early seasons featured Kia Goodwin as Rose Holloway's daughter, Tiffany. However, Tiffany underwent significant changes, with reduced screen time in the second season and an unexplained disappearance by the fourth, similar to character vanishings in other notable sitcoms. In a clever nod to her past, Marla Gibbs recreated a memorable scene from The Jeffersons in one of 227's episodes, adding a nostalgic touch for viewers familiar with her earlier work. Despite the familiar bell moment, 227, set in contemporary Washington, D.C., brought a fresh perspective to the narrative, capturing the essence of everyday life in a close-knit community. Reflecting on the show's creative elements, the vision of creators Reed and Malcolm Jamal Warner laid the foundation for the lasting charm of 227. Behind the scenes, the production team, including Marla Gibbs, ensured an authentic portrayal of life's highs and lows, crafting a series that went beyond the typical sitcom format. Delving into the rich story of 227, the careful casting process resulted in an ensemble that not only entertained but resonated with a diverse audience. The series became a proof of the enduring power of humor, heart, and genuine connections, solidifying its place in television history.